Hey, I want to encourage you today for some power evangelism methods of reaching the harvest. Uh, there's so many different ones that we've come across over time of doing outreach and, and ministering to uh, different people. And uh, one of the best ones I've ever heard uh, was from a friend of mine who said that he really got his start in ministry. And whenever they would go out to a restaurant, when the waitress would come and they would begin to uh, uh, take their drink order, you know, like say they were going to come and say, do you want Coke, water, lemonade, whatever. And they'd say, okay, I'll be back for your food order. And so they had like a little game, like a spiritual game that as she left with the drink order, what, she, what the, my friends would do is they would say, okay, everyone pray in the spirit. Let's get a word for the waitress. And so everyone around the table would begin to pray in the spirit and say, all right, God, give me a word, give me a word, give me a word. And as they begin to get done praying and the waitress would come back, uh, they would begin to say to the waitress, hey, listen, do you believe that God can speak today? And often just opening her heart and opening her thoughts that God wants to speak today. If God can speak today, then God wants to speak today. And just in that little open door by them saying that to her, most of the times, more often than not, they would say, uh, the waitress would say, well, of course I do. Oh, great. Well, listen, we were praying for you. We're spiritual people. And as we were praying for you, when you left with our drink order, this is what God showed us. And many of them would write it on a napkin so they could see, she could see on the napkin what they had gotten for her. And often that waitress would be so impacted by these incredible prophetic words that she would be moved or he would be moved if it was a waiter. And they would be so incredibly moved by the Holy Spirit uh, just because of those prophetic words. And so prophetic evangelism is a very, very powerful way, power evangelism, to impact the harvest, to see a greater fruit come uh, from people uh, who are, are evangelized. Instead of just by word only, there's power behind it and there's an impact. Uh, another method of which of, of ministering to people is in going to hospitals and going to the emergency room. I mean, we, we've done that before where we've sent teams of people to go to emergency rooms and, and just boom, they just go into the emergency rooms and they'll just say things like, I'm a minister in training. And uh, then they go and then they pray for the sick and the sick are healed. Uh, we just had that happen just not too long ago. And a group of, we sent teams of people to all of the hospitals nearby at about 11 o'clock at night. And they came back the next night with incredible testimonies of people they had prayed over, they had prophesied over, brought healing, brought salvation, the whole nine yards, all of it. And that person was so impacted because here they are in an emergency room, obviously in pain, obviously in a life-threatening situation. And boom, then all of a sudden God comes and ministers to them. So these are a couple of great methods of which that you can go on out and impact the harvest. So, so give that a shot today. You know, go on out. The next time you go to the restaurant, just begin to pray in the spirit. Begin to say those who are with you, okay, everyone get a word for the waitress. Almost like a spiritual game that you begin to uh, uh, hone your prophetic gifting, hone your uh, word of knowledge and in, in ministering to people. Not, a, not as a show, but to impact people because you love them for the kingdom. And so give that a shot today, the next time you go out or whatever it might be, or just go and take a team of people with you to the hospital and just start praying over people, pray for the sick, and, and you'll be shocked how many people get saved. Hey, I wanna encourage you today, go to our website, www.sharethefire.org. Sharethefire.org, check out our website. We've got tons of material. Tons of revival literature and, and all kinds of different worship and stuff that'll really feed your spirit. Uh, secondly, I want you to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Right below you is our YouTube channel subscription. Click on subscribe today. That would be great. And you could always get these updates coming to you from different things of our ministry, whether it's in power evangelism or revival, whatever it might be. But subscribe today, right below you today. Go for it. Just put, just click on the subscribe button right below you. All right. Awesome. Bless you.